So hey, oh, uh, hey Fruity, it's me, Zara, hashtag Maya Granger, and my Australian flag, because I, of course, talking about somewhere in Australia. Where? Well, it is in Sydney, and in fact, it is an island, which is much known as Cockatoo Island. So, let's get started. Putting on my Hermione voice. Kokshu Island is one of the largest of several islands that were originally heavily timbered sandstone knolls. Originally, the island rose up to 18 metres, 59 feet above sea level and was 12.9 hectares, 32 acres, but has been extended to 17.9 hectares, 44 acres and is now cleared of most vegetation. Cockatoo Island was called Wa-ri-ma by the indigenous Australians who traditionally inhabited the land prior to European settlement, as the island may have been used as a fishing base, although physical evidence of Aboriginal heritage lists have, have not been found on the island. Between 1839 and 1869, Cockatoo Island was used for a convict establishment. Primary punishment for convicts who have re-offended the colonies. It was also the site of one of the biggest shipyards in Australia. Operating, operating between 1857 and 1991. Well, Hermione, please. The first two dry decks in the shipyard were built by convicts. Cockatoo Island is significant for its demonstration of the characteristics of a long-running dockyard and shipbuilding complex, which includes evidence of key functions, structures, and has the potential to enhance understanding of maritime and heavily industrial drill processes in Australia from mid 19th century. <sighs> Hermione boys, still on. Please don't judge me by this guys. I did the worst drawing any could have. This is for people who like pink. Let's get to it. The island is managed by this the island is managed by the Sydney Harbour Federation Trust, which is also responsible for seven other islands around the harbour. The Harbour Trust is re retilalising an island landmark harbour attraction with cultural events and heritage interpretation. Today, Cockatoo Island retains and rem remunerates of the island's past. Its prison buildings contain a few of the original industrial artifacts, another remaining industrial her heritage, including the docks, cushions, and cranes are operational. It is difficult to see how the island functioned as a dockyard for over a century. Island is well known historically. Thank you guys for listening, and I just hope you enjoyed it. And convicts should have been treated the same as us now, but things were cooler. It didn't mean that how the rich people were treated, the poor people had to be treated. I mean, if they saw a tiny bit, they should have well been put in a prison in England. They should, they should have built more prisons. They should have built underwater prisons. They, they just shouldn't have treated English people like that. I mean, if it wasn't for them, we probably wouldn't be here. But that's the thing. Need to be treated equally. Bye.